Hey guys, Nick from Fluid Damper. Today we're talking Duramax, part number 830111 for the 06 to 2010 LBZ LMM. We're going to give this uh, an open up here and show you what you get inside. Now, if you've seen the Gal Banks video, you've seen him have a great struggle getting this box open. I pre opened it. Uh, I'm not falling for that. Inside, you'll have your SFI sticker on this card, installation instructions, installation instructions, as well as the fluid damper sticker, so you can show us off, tell everybody that not to mess with you, you're running a fluid damper. So we're gonna go ahead and pull this out. Inside, you have your, your damper. Be careful, these babies are heavy. Now, one thing on the weight of them, the uh, the mass, as uh, we've said in our other videos, for uh, torsional vibration and some of our questions, um, the mass is what's needed to control the vibrations. So you will find that these are slightly heavier. Um, the rotating weight on these dampers is about two thirds of the actual weight. So rotating weight, we get a lot of questions on that. It's uh, what the damper is uh, actually putting on the crank. So what the crank actually feels would be the rotating weight. So back to the damper here, black zinc chromate, engraved fluid damper, along with your SFI number and your part number again, 830111. There's a timing mark on here. These dampers are keyed from the factory. There is the um, Duramax dampers are a slip fit, so they will go on and off. Uh, you shouldn't need any kind of tool. If they get stuck, you may need a little persuasion. Uh, they are externally balanced, as you can see here, with the counterweight. So uh, lining it up with the key is e extreme importance. The... Uh, the best way we found is to uh, strategically place the mass as close to the crank or to the engine as possible. This alleviates any excess weight hanging way out. We know uh, the factory damper and other uh, manufacturers have that weight hanging way out on the, uh, on the damper itself. Uh, we found it best to integrate it and put it inside. Uh, again, it's a strategic place. Uh, and definitely is a, a great improvement. As I said, Gail Banks uses our dampers on all his projects, and uh, he can't say enough about them. Stock belt, stock uh, size, so you don't have to worry about replacing your belt with uh, a different part number or anything. It will use the same one you're, you're, you're currently using. Uh, so again, for the uh, part number 830111 uh, Duramax LBZ LMM, uh, if you have any questions about this damper or any of our other products, feel free to leave us a comment below or shoot us an email at support at fluiddamper.com. If there's a damper you'd like to learn more about, let us know. We'll see you guys soon. Hope you guys are staying safe.